Hey, what's going on? LaPrentice here, and I help health conscious consumers replace toxic products in their, from their life so they can achieve true wellness. In today's video, we're going to find out is purified water safe to drink? All right, so if you have not subscribed to this channel yet, make sure you do that so you can get more of the tips, tricks, and tactics that will help you boost and improve your overall wellness. With that being said, here we go. Purified drinking water. Look at this. It says purified says it's drinking water, and guess what? It's not meant for drinking. Do not, I highly recommend not drinking this water, okay? I don't care what it says right here on this bottle. I don't know if you can see it. it says purified drinking water. It doesn't matter what company, it doesn't matter. This is all a sales tactic. It's purified water, all right? That, they're not lying to you there. And when you think of the word purified, you think of cleaned or you think of like pure, like godliness right like cleanliness right so i'm going to show you why this is a bad thing all right so first off purify water it could be done this could be purified by a variety of means it could be done through reverse osmosis where the water is pushed through a very very fine membrane and the water comes out clean on the other side it could be done distillation process where they take your water boil it into a steam and then they catch the steam Either way, regardless, or if they do it any other way, the bottom line is this. Any method that they use, or a combination of, they are removing the minerals from the water. Your body is 75% water, and you need the best water for your health, and the minerals that they're removing is essential for your body to have. So I wanna show you, really quick, I'm gonna take some of this purified water, pour this cup, we're gonna talk about more about those minerals in a minute and why that's such a bad thing. But the first thing that I want to show you is that this water is oxidizing, okay? And oxidation, when you're consuming things that are oxidizing, that's gonna harm our cells. It's gonna start taking out electrons from our healthy cells. And it's gonna make those oxidized as well. And it's gonna end up leading to inflammation. That oxidation and inflammation leads to every single health disease known to man. And so it's highly recommended that you don't consume this water. So this, um, ORP meter is going to show a positive number and the reason why it's going to show a positive number is because this water is positively charged which means it's creating aging and oxidation and rust in our body right so let me see if I can you can see that look at that okay this is essentially not what our cells need so we're rusting on the inside it's like this banana I have here, right? You want to look good like these bananas over here and not this resting one, okay? And our water helps us when we have an antioxidant water so that actually help push out those toxins, okay? And the second thing I want to show you is the main thing, which is this water is acidic, okay? And because it's acidic, it's actually, not only is it not providing you minerals, it is eating the minerals that are in your body, all right? So you need your potassium, your magnesium, your sodium in you. Okay, your body needs these. And so I'm gonna put a few of these pH drops in here. And if the water turns an orange, a red or orange or a yellow, that means it's acidic. And if it shows up a uh, blue or purple or dark purple, then it is alkaline, right? And so as you can see, I put a few drops in here and this water is acidic, which means when you're consuming this, if you are consuming this water, please don't any of the water you're consuming, this is going to start taking those minerals and taking them out of your bones, your skin. So if you have any eczema, if you have any bones that are feeling brittle, if you have cartilage issues, it's because of the water that you're consuming. If you're consuming this, it is acidic and it is eating the minerals away from your body and then you evacuate it when you go to the bathroom. So you, this is not water you want to drink. So what is purified water good for? Purified water is good for things that do not require minerals, but require water, okay? So we as humans, living creatures, do not um, need to be drinking this purified water. So anything electrical, right? So think of your iron, right? If you're gonna use a iron to steam your clothes, that water, this water is good for an iron, okay? It's good for a diffuser, right? Because those are all little machines that this water can go into and it's gonna allow the water to do its thing and not clog up the iron, not clog up the diffuser. 
those are the main reasons why you want to, pretty much the only reasons why you want to use purified water. Okay, so if you are curious and you want to learn actually what water is good for you and what the best water is, feel free to reach out to me, ApprenticeSampson.com. That's my website. You can also find me on Facebook. With a name like that, it's pretty easy to find me on Facebook and we can chat. And last but not least, you want to make sure you subscribe so you can learn about the other kinds of waters that are out there in the world because there's so many. And the last thing we want to do is harm your health. We want to actually help improve your health and wellness. So, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.